Hey, what's up, YouTube? This your boy PJ2 Hot here. I'm back for another video. Today, I'm doing a upgrade to my PC. I got a new GPU. It's not extremely more powerful than my last GPU. I mean, it's about what they say 20. It's like 20% more powerful, or 30%. 25%, 20%, 30%, one of those three. But uh, it's the GTX 1080, you can tell by the title, enough of that. And uh, I'm just gonna unbox it here. I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it for you guys. And I got a 1070 in, and the, both the cards look the same. You know what I mean? So you can't, as far as the way they look, they look exactly the same, they have the same features as far as look, look and design. And I went for that on purpose because I didn't want it to look tacky inside my, um, um, case you know my computer my bad I just I, my mind went blank uh and I'm still gonna keep keep the 1070 for now I might just use it I, I so, 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 some, some people some people might not agree with this but I might go ahead and use it as a physics card and I know there are not many games out there that support physics it's like a, not a lot at all and like a lot of people say physics cards are pointless because there's not many games that, that do physics anyway though so what's the point and that's true but if you already got the card just laying around, why not? You know I mean, if it, I mean, like me, I have a lot of GPUs laying around that I haven't sold yet. I got a lot of GPUs, like AMD GPUs, NVIDIA GPUs. They're laying around. I, I just haven't sold them yet. They're just sitting here. So I'm like, yeah, instead of just having them sit, because I, I don't sell my computer parts. I just don't. I just usually keep them, because I always have this what-if factor. You never know. You always got the backup plans just laying around just in case. You know what I mean? And that's the reason why I keep my computer parts. So that's the reason why I have... um. My, keep my 1070 and, and, and use it as a physics card. But if the time comes and I really need the money, yeah, I'll sell it. You know what I mean? I'll probably sell it for 500 if the time comes. But right now, I'm fine. So, anyways, though, enough of that. Enough of the talking. Enough of all that like that. Let's get to this unboxing.
All right, guys, so here's the GPUs. I have them in there. Have it all set up and ready to go. It is late at night. Um, I started doing this, you know, like during the day, obviously, with the video, and then I ran into to some issues with this. So first off, as you can see, I, I, okay, like I will say this. Both GPUs in here looks it looks great. Like having two GPUs in a system looks way better, way better than having one. But okay, the problem. Um, oh, like once I installed them and I set the computer back up on my desk and I turned it on, my computer kept shutting off, and it kept doing it. And I kept checking. The second one of the uh, one of the LED fans right here would not would, the lights and and the fan itself would not come on. When I one of the wires in there, I think have a shortage in it, but. It kept shutting off and eventually I figured out that the RAM I had wasn't seated in there properly. So once I figured that out, I got everything set up and running, installed the drivers. It turns out I installed old drivers from 2016 by accident. That caused some issues as well. Um, it wasn't my second GPU, the 1070 that down here wasn't showing up you know, for me to uh, dedicate it to physics. So with that being said, the fact that it wouldn't show up, I didn't know what to do. You know what I mean? And I, I realized I installed drivers from 2016, and that was the issue. So, you know, I had to, I went through a lot of pro, like just craziness was going on. And then I finally figured out what I had to do. And I uninstalled the old drivers, fresh, clean, all the, all the NVIDIA drivers on here. I, I pretty much like uninstalled all of it. Then I came and reinstalled the driver, uh, the, the newest drivers in, and then everything registered and both fans were working properly. Uh, both GPUs and GPUs were, were uh, working properly, as you can see, and I just set them up both to the same color. Um, and it's pretty cool. I, I like how on this app you can, uh, I'll show you, you can um, change the color of each one if you want to. You see this the bottom one, right? I'm going to change it to blue. Now the bottom one is blue, you know what I mean? Then I'm going to go to the top one. All you do is you click it right here at the top, and it goes there. And then you just, just change it to blue. As you can see, it just changes to blue. You can change it to any color that you want, you know what I mean? Or you can have it set to uh, like where it just cycles through all the colors and everything like that. But you know, red 